personal strength and conditioning coach. Welcome to my channel. Today we are going to focus on legs. So previously, because this new series is all about Pilates, all about body weight, you're not gonna need anything but yourself, but please do warm up because we don't include a warm up in this. So for this session alone, we're gonna work all about legs. So it'll be lengthening the legs, tightening all the inside thighs, the outside thighs, the glutes, and the hamstrings, okay? So if you haven't already subscribed, make sure you subscribe so you're able to find new videos like this each week and like this video so more people can find videos like this on YouTube and that would very much support the channel and everything I'm doing with you guys to give you more content like this, okay? So without further ado, let's get started on your lean legs strong sequence today. We're gonna lay it on the floor, bottom leg bent, top leg raise, and we're just gonna push forward, back, lift, and lower. Forward, back, lift and lower keep going forward back lift and lower so pull the navel in squeeze the glutes squeeze the legs so everything's nice and tight yeah excellent <laughs> i can definitely feel my obliques you can match this up with our core video that we've done as well so these two sequences Maybe I'll combo them myself and add it to the sequence. Whew. Okay, this time we're gonna extend that bottom leg and then tuck that knee, that foot behind the knee. So we're gonna touch the knee to the floor, lift up, leg raise, okay? So knee to floor, lift up, let's go. Knee to floor, lift up, leg raise. So we're gonna do everything on one side, and then of course we're gonna swap over and do it on the other. When you kick that leg, point those toes. You're gonna feel this in your glutes. Oh my gosh, I definitely feel it in mine. <laughs> okay, keep pulling in the belly button, keep pulling in the glutes. Last five seconds. Amazing, okay, so this time you get to lean into the side, pull the navel in, and I just want you to go forward and up. So forward, so toe tap the forward foot. And if you need that little bit more stability, you can bend that bottom leg, so this is Definitely focusing on those glutes, outside thighs, because you're pointing the toes, inside thighs too, yeah? Keep pushing that leg forward, as far forward as you can. <laughs> ah. Oh my gosh, this burns. 10 seconds, you've got this. Five. <laughs> Beautiful. Oh. oh, give that leg a little bit of a massage. So we're gonna go into 45 degree leg circles and we're gonna kick it forward. We're gonna circle, kick it back, circle the same direction. So we're gonna go clockwise forward, reach back, clockwise side. So forward, clockwise, back, clockwise. This is evil, I know, because we've all done this on the same leg. Okay, forward, circle, back, circle, and again, whoo, back, circle. Come on, halfway, over halfway. 10 more seconds, circle, back, we are not done with this leg, we've just got one more exercise before we switch sides. So the circles that we did outwards, we're now gonna go the other way. So we're gonna circle inwards, 
forward circle inward. So anti-clockwise, if you did anti-clockwise previously, you're obviously gonna circle the other way. So anti-clockwise back, anti-clockwise forward. Back and forward. Beautiful, keep it going, keep that navel nice and strong. Keep the glutes working, kick that foot forward as far as you can go. Push and reach. Whew. And breathe. <laughs> Good, keep going. Ten more seconds from here. And rest. So over. So we do the whole thing now on the other side. So remember, elbow first, and then we're gonna kick that bottom leg. Okay. So in this position, we're gonna like raise the leg up and forward. Beautiful. So leg raise, point and forward. Beautiful. So pulling in from the navel. Kicking it as far forward as you can, keep those toes pointed the whole time. Yeah, you can go into point and flex if you are an advanced Pilates person. But um, this is just it for ease. You can just keep it pointed this whole time. Beautiful, okay, so foot behind the knee this time. Knee in, lift, kick up, okay? So that's your next exercise. When we're ready, in three, two, one, let's go. Point and raise, point and raise. Good, keep it going. So we're gonna definitely feel the glutes on this one. <laughs> Good, last five seconds. Don't collapse into the elbow. Lift from the elbow. Beautiful, now we get to rest forward and just lean on your arm. We're gonna lift and lower from the bottom of the foot, okay? So, kicking the foot full, far forward as much as you can. Lift and lower, let's go. You got this. So kick that foot forward as much as you possibly can and raise up from the glutes. Keeping the core engaged so it's keeping you nice and stable, nice and strong. We even got one more exercise on this leg. Come on, we've got this. 15 more seconds. Two. Whew. Last one. Beautiful, okay. So remember on this one, we're gonna go for circle. I'm gonna go for anti-clockwise on this side first. Then I'm gonna go anti-clockwise forward, okay? So give it a little bit of a rest, a little bit of a massage. When you're ready, anti-clockwise side, anti-clockwise forward and lower. Lean it back, kick it forward, keep it going. Keep breathing. Last 10 seconds. Your glutes will thank you. 
Okay, beautiful. So this time we're gonna go clockwise and the other side. So this is the last, last bit, last bit. I know your legs are aching right now, but you're doing an awesome job. Okay, so clockwise, point, clockwise, circle forward. Clockwise, circle, forward, circle. <laughs> point those toes. Keep going. This is no joke. <laughs> Evil. Okay, keep going. 10 seconds. Circle. Circle. Let's do one more. And rest. Okay, let me just reset my timer a second. So this time we're gonna go to the single leg bridge. So come all the way back onto your back, feet planted, low with control. So I'm gonna lift my one leg up and then push my heel into the floor. So really squeeze the glutes at the top, tuck your chin in, pull that navel to the spine. Squeeze the glutes at the top, keep going. You got this. You guys are doing awesome. Keep pushing that left foot into the floor. Beautiful. Remember if you need any rest, just sweep the legs from left to right. Give those legs, glutes a little bit of a rest. We're going to swap over to the right side this time. Right foot planted into the floor. Lift up with those hips and tuck that chin in. So pushing the right foot into the mat. Opening up those hips, squeeze the glutes to the top. Good. Keep going. Ten more seconds. We are almost on the home straight. We're almost done. Beautiful. Plant both feet into the mat this time. Make sure your sacrum is pulling into the navel. So lower back into the mat. Push both feet down into the floor and we're going to squeeze up and pulse. This is your glute bridge pulses. Keep squeezing. Now we're supposed to do this for 60 seconds, so we've got no rest in between these next few seconds, okay? So ignore the bell, that just gives you a 15 minute warning. 15 minute, 15 second warning. And this way, we've got 60 seconds worth of exercises right to the end, okay? So I'm pretty sure we've only got four more to go. But if anyone knows me, do not rely on my counting, because it's pretty shoddy. Okay, keep squeezing up. We're gonna go straight down and up with our glute bridges, okay? So keep squeezing, keep squeezing. Last 15 seconds. That was our warning. <laughs> so before we did 45 seconds on 15 seconds changeover, but we're not gonna need those extra 15 seconds. Let's use them. We're gonna lower with control. Pulse up, push the knees outwards. Lower with control, push up with those feet. Push the knees outwards. This is your 60 second. Push out, lower with control. Squeeze the glutes at the top, push outwards. Beautiful. Push into the mat. As soon as you hit the top, just push those knees slightly outwards, but do not drop your hips. Good. 30 more seconds to go. You're going to get a 15 second warning. We are on the home straight. Keep going. 
that was your 15 second warm-up. Keep going. Pull outwards. Push those knees. Squeeze those glutes at the top. Beautiful. Okay, this time we're gonna go all the way down, all the way back up. So all the way down. But this time, if you wanna make it harder, pull those toes up. And let's work more into those hamstrings. So kick those feet out if you want to make it harder. Heels into the mat, lower with control. Lift up, squeeze the glutes, lower with control. Do not arch the back. We're pulling in the sacrum into the spine. So tucking our glutes in. Pull in. So we want a nice alignment. You're going to feel this at the back of your legs. Pull the navel into the spine, push those heels into the mat. Keep going. That was your 15 second warning. That went so quick. So 15 more seconds, we've got one more exercise after this and you are done, okay? So keep going. Beautiful. Feet together on this one, knees out wide, and we're gonna pulse up and hold up. So this is your frog kick but we're doing it supine. So, push the feet into the floor, pull those knees outwards, and squeeze the glutes up. Good work. Keep squeezing, keep squeezing. Squeeze the glutes, push those hips up, push those feet into the mat. Keep going. 30 more seconds. For those who want an extra bonus, we're gonna do an isometric hold right at the end. This is optional. I did promise you one. This was the last exercise. Keep going, we've got about 15 second warning. So for those of you who want that extra bit of glute hamstring by burner, in five seconds, we're gonna hold up into an isometric glute bridge. So feet back into the floor, hip distance apart, squeeze the glutes up and hold. Hold, hold, hold. This is your bonus round. If you've stuck with me so far, fantastic work. Make sure you do this exercise at least twice or three times a week for the next four weeks and see how much your glutes transform. So it's super, super short, super effective. Keep lifting up the hips, keep pushing the feet into the floor. Remember, we've got our 15 second warning coming up. So we are almost on the home straight. Keep squeezing, I know those thighs are hurting. Keep squeezing the glutes. That's our 15 second warning. Keep breathing. <laughs> this is all worth it. This is so worth it. Keep squeezing the glutes. Keep pushing those knees outwards. Last, last five seconds. Four, three, two, ah! Oh my gosh. Knees in towards the chest and just rock from side to side. Oh my gosh, I hope you enjoyed that one as much as I did. And that's a special thank you to Lily Sabri, who is a phenomenal and she inspired a lot of those leg raises that we did. So if you haven't already, click subscribe, hit the notification bell, and make sure you don't miss out on future videos. And yeah, like this video so more people can find content like this on YouTube. I love you so much. Have an amazing day. And make sure you keep working on those glutes. Mwah.